Hello, my young friends. I hope all of you are doing well. I want you to raise your hand if you had a good week last week. Come on, raise them high. Well, I had a really good week last week, and I hope you did too. Today, I want to talk to you about something very important. I was cleaning out a drawer the other day, and I came across these cool little binoculars. Now, binoculars come in all shapes and sizes, and these are my small ones, and I love these because they're easy to hold, and you can look through them, and you can see things far away. For instance, I can sit on my deck, and I can look at the birds in the trees and I can tell what kinds of feathers they have. I can look at their beaks. I can see their feet. I can even watch them fly. I used to take these binoculars with me when I would go to the ballet because I always liked to look very closely at the dancers, especially to see if they had good feet. Anyway, binoculars are great to have, and like I said, they come in different sizes. They help us to look at things more closely. Well, one other thing I've been doing since COVID started, besides cleaning out drawers, is I've really been reading more in my Bible. I have been taking a closer look at scriptures, and the binoculars remind me that that's a really good idea for all of us to do. Not only is it good for us to read the Bible, not just when we're told to or when we're asked to, but really sit down and read some Bible verses and learn from them. The Old Testament is full of history and it's full of God's laws and God teaching us how to get along with each other and how we should live. The New Testament is all about God's promises and the life of Jesus. And the more you read, the more you learn. And the more you learn, the better Christian you'll be. You'll be able to show kindness and generosity. You'll be able to serve God by helping other people. And the main thing is you will be able to learn God's Word. So the Bible is the most important book you can have for learning how to be a good person. So the next time you see a pair of binoculars, think about taking a closer look at your Bible. Ask your parents to help you too. They will help you read and learn different stories and they will help you learn about Jesus and how we are supposed to be like him in the way we treat other people, in the way that we act, and in the way that we serve God. So get those Bibles out and take a closer look Alrighty, I hope you all have a good week next week. I'm so excited because I think we're getting closer and closer to being able to go back to church. And that means we can see each other. Now, we'll still have to be socially distanced because COVID is not over, but we can at least look at each other and smile and see each other. Okay, boys and girls, have a good week, and let's stop now and say a prayer. Please bow your heads. Dear God, thank you for giving us the ability to take a closer look at your Bible, at your word, at your stories. Help it to teach us the way to live and help us to learn from it. We ask this in the name of your son, Jesus. Amen. Okay, boys and girls, I hope you have a wonderful week next week. Remember, I love you, and I'm looking forward to seeing you hopefully very soon. Bye-bye.